Yes guys, in this video I will show you how you can install Lineage OS 16 or Android 9 in your S3 new. So you have to install these two zip files. You can find link in description. The first one is Lineage OS 16 zip file. The second one is OpenGF zip file. And guys, this custom ROM is not fully stable. You may find some bugs. In my case, my SIM card is not working and there is not any stock camera in this custom ROM. So you have to manually flash the camera. And guys, make sure your battery is at least 60% charged and TWR recovery is stored. So if you haven't installed the TWR recovery, so watch my video, link is in description. And guys, now power of your device, my power button has broken so i am using this tool and guys now you have to go to your your twr recovery so to boot into twr recovery hold the volume up key the home key and the power key at the same time like i am holding and guys keep holding until you see the boot logo as the boot logo is here then guys leave all the keys and guys wait So I am booted into my TWR recovery and guys before installing any custom ROM make sure to backup your previous ROM so watch my video link is in description how you can backup your ROM in case of any break so you can restore your ROM and guys now hit on the wipe button and go to advance and guys now check the Dalvik cache system data and the cache and guys do not check the internal storage it will remove your all storage and guys do not check the internal storage and guys now swipe right to continue so it will take about one minute and guys now click on the home button and guys go to stall so here is your internal storage that's why i said do not clear your internal storage and guys now click on the lineage os 16 zip file and guys swipe right to stall so it will take about 5 to 10 minutes so guys keep watching so it has been stalled and guys now click on the back button and hit on the open gf's zip file and guys swipe right to stall and here you have to again wait for 5 to 10 minutes. Now guys hit on the reboot system button and guys click on the do not stall button. And guys the boot up will take about 5 to 10 minutes so here you have to wait again. So guys. My system has been booted so I am in the setup wizard so let me complete it first. So guys now you are on fresh android 9 or android p onto your s3 new smartphone so if you find this video helpful so hit on the like button and subscribe my channel and guys make sure to click on the bell icon to never miss any video and guys thanks for watching as you can see i am on android 9 or android p so guys thanks for watching